we had a cottage in Narragansett right across from uh, George of uh, Galilee. Every morning, uh, we weren't supposed to, but we would walk him on the beach. As long as we were there before, say, 8 o'clock, nobody really said anything, you know. I would tether them together, Roscoe and Riley, on a harness so that I would only have to hold one leash. Roscoe absolutely loved the water, but Riley did not like the water. <laughs> Roscoe would run and uh, run towards the water, and Riley would do everything in his power to stop him. And, you know, of course the uh, waves would come in and his feet would get wet and he would be so mad. <laughs> But one time, Roscoe was going either after a toy or something in the, we had thrown in the water, and he just pulled him right in. Oh, my God. Riley was mad, and he ran, and he pulled Roscoe, believe it or not, because Roscoe's twice the size of Riley. Yeah. It was nuts. It was so funny. It was great. <laughs> you would think Riley would like the water. He was from Tulum, Mexico, right there on the beach. But I guess his foster mom didn't expose him to it, so... Anyway, he's afraid of the water. Crazy dog. Do you have a wacky story to share? DM me and maybe I'll feature it on a future episode.